What is up, guys? My name is Ebenezer Friend Pong, and welcome back to the channel. Now, something that you guys may not realize is that for every single person that teaches Shopify, whether that's through YouTube or Instagram or whatever platform that they so choose, you get a lot of emails, a ton of DMs from people asking you to review their Shopify store. And for me personally, I've actually had the opportunity to go into people's stores and help them tweak and fix certain things. And when I'm in these stores, I notice the exact same thing across all of them. They all copy and paste trust badges into their product descriptions for every single product that they have on their store, which is perfectly fine. But what happens when you have 50, 100, maybe 150 products? At that point, copying and pasting for every single product on your store becomes extremely, extremely tedious and time consuming. So that is why I want to teach you guys my way of adding trust badges to my product pages in Shopify. I use one line of code that I add to my store and the trust badge will be instantly added to every single product page on my store. Whether there are old products or new products, a trust badge is automatically added to every product page, right? I don't have to worry about copying and pasting. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is the art of working smarter, not harder. And I want to teach that to you. But before I do that, I want to show you guys something. So my very first or second upload, right after they were uploaded and started getting traction, a lot of people started reaching out to me, asking me to make an AdWords or Shopify course. And no, that's not what this announcement is. I do not have an AdWords or Shopify course but my buddy Marco Rodriguez does. Marco has over 6,000 YouTube subscribers at this very moment, and Marco's course is actually what helped me sharpen my search ads skills. See, shopping ads, I became very good self-taught with shopping ads. You know, I learned through mistakes. I needed some tips when it came to search ads, and Marco's course is what helped me out. And he actually reached out to me recently with an affiliate link to help him promote his course. And that's what I'm going to do. And I'm going to stand behind it because his course is extremely useful. It's valuable information that actually works and it's actually helpful. It's an actual skill that you're learning in this course. So if you're looking to learn much more in detail stuff about search campaigns, advanced techniques or stuff like that, this is the course for you. And it's going to be the very first link in my description. Oh. There I am right here, Ebenezer Frimpong. AdWords is the underdog of the Ecom community. So you guys can go ahead and enroll the Ecom PPC Academy if you like. And without further ado, let's get started. As you guys can see, I'm inside the demo Shopify store that I created for my YouTube channel. Now, to add a trust badge to your Shopify store, with the method that I'm going to teach you, the same method that I use for my stores, you're gonna need two things. The first thing you're gonna need is the code snippet that you're gonna to add to your theme, which is right over here. The second thing you're gonna need is of course a trust badge. And yes, this is the one that I use and this is the one I'm using for this example. You guys will be able to download both of these two things in the description. If you don't wanna use this one right here, you can just go to Google and Google trust badges or go to a Shopify store that has one that you like and just download theirs. Now when you do this make sure you get one that has a transparent background so it's going to be a .png file. Once you have that the next thing you're going to do is head over to settings, go to files, and you're going to upload that trust badge that you have into files. Now for every single thing you upload into the file section you get a URL for it. You're going to copy the URL for the trust badge, copy, and then you're going to bring it over to the code snippet, highlight where it says insert Shopify file URL here, and paste that trust badge URL like so. Boom. You're done. The next thing you're going to do is head over to online store, go to actions, go to edit code. Scroll down all the way to sections and look for products dash template. Boom, product that template. 
and just click anywhere in here. So you can click right up here. You're going to use Control F or Command F and just type in product dot description and it already populated and found it right down here so now you're gonna copy this entire snippet like so and you're gonna go right over here right underneath this closing division tag hit enter and just paste that code hit save Congratulations, ladies and gentlemen. That is all. You have just added a trust badge to every single product page in your store. And just to double check, let's go to the store. So pop that open. Catalog. Boom. Ta da. There you go. And Every time you add a new product, you don't have to repeat this process. When you add a new product, this will automatically be there. So no more copy and pasting, you're done with that. Now before someone hops into the comments like, hey, there's an app for this, yes there is an app for it. And I'll go ahead and show you that app actually. So we'll go to apps, there's a Shopify app store. The name of that app is Free Trust Bads by Hector. Boom. And this is what it looks like. Now, the reason why I don't use this app is because every single app that you add to your store slows down your site speed. I want you guys to keep that in mind. That plays a huge factor when it comes to conversions. So if you can do something yourself and it's not something super major, you don't need this app. You can just add it yourself. And as you guys just saw, it doesn't take much to do. It's very simple to do. But if you do want to use the app, the app is called Free Trust Bads by Hector. Go right ahead. Thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to like, comment, share, and most definitely subscribe and turn on my notification bells. See you guys next time. Talking crazy in a hallway, you sure are something. How you figure you're the only one that's paid us? Whole lot of shit changed in the last year, yeah, yeah. That still ain't no excuse. I ain't playing no games, me no.